Take I'm gonna take the gift back. <laughs> The only time you call is when you need some breath from me. Sit and talk for think of Yo, what's up? It's your Shay Frost. And before I start this video, make sure you go to my music channel at the Shay Frost on YouTube and subscribe. Turn on the post notifications there. I'll be posting music videos, music interviews, all types of interviews, everything music related. I'll be doing giveaways every now and then. So make sure you go there, subscribe, and turn on the post notifications so you know when I post. And let's get it popping. You dig? Yo, what's up? It's your buddy Shay Frost. And, um,. Uh... I know a lot of you guys are here because of the title of this video. Uh, make sure you guys go listen to New to LA. The link in the description right now. It just came out on YouTube and SoundCloud and stuff. It's probably my best. It's, it is my best song yet. So make sure you guys check that out. It is my intro music. So if you want the music for that, but um, as you guys know, yeah, we I've been talking about the. I, I literally been. I haven't been going home and stuff. I've been out and about. You know, just spending at a friend's house and stuff like that. Just because I, I just don't really like the vibes. We just have to crib right now. And just everything. And you guys know my mom does these things on Sundays where where um she gets, like, people together, filming together. And people, you know what I'm saying, just coming over every Sunday. And happy Easter to y'all. Happy Easter to everybody. God blessing y'all and stuff like that. I hope that everything is going well. But um, it's Sunday, so I'm here with somebody, you know, somebody you guys might know. And here he is right here. What's up, the y'all? The man himself. I you know. know. Okay, so I want to get this first thing, like, right, bro. Mm -hmm. I have no problem with you at all. Not really. I just don't like, like, my girl. My, my girl. My sister <laughs> has been, she's been, she's been, like, very, like, she hasn't been on her work. You know what I'm saying? Right. She hasn't been on her work stuff like as good as I want her to be. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And I feel like that's because of your guys' relationship. I see you guys talking all the time on the phone, all the time, and I have no problem with that at all. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? It's just like when she's not doing her work and it's affecting her family, then I feel like it's taking a break. You know? Yeah, I feel you. You know what I mean? I'm mean, saying like, how's you guys like? Have you guys been talking and stuff like? That? I know you've been yeah, sneaking been and talking. stuff like that <laughs> and whatever, bro. You know, and all that stuff like. Yeah, we've been talking. We've been talking to be honest with you. For real? Yeah, talking. So you guys don't listen? I mean... Hey, what you expect? I mean, I don't know. I'm not going to be like whatever, like make sure everything's cool. I was just trying to make sure everything, you know, was just good between... You and me, and also oh, yeah, just solid. no. Of course, I I, I mess with you. You know what I'm saying. I'm yeah. just trying to make sure she's good. And I always got to make sure she's in a good position, no matter what. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying. You guys are, you guys staying clean, right? You guys both virgins and everything, right? Of course. Good. Got to stay strapped. Up. You know. I'm just trying to give you that talk, bro. You yeah. know, whatever. Like, you know, if this lasts for a month, uh, uh, eight months, or eight years, or. One day, you know, I want everything to be cool and, co and quadruple. You feel me? Yeah. Like, I don't want no weird, funny shit going on. You feel me? Because yeah, I'm still a brother at the end of the day, you know? And I focus trying to see, you know, you guys are cool. Like, you guys be doing the matching and this shit is cute, you know? I'm yeah. saying, I just want you guys to be cool. And, if, and if, she, if, if her and you guys being together is happy, then I'm all for it. You know what I mean? I'm coming to the point to where yeah. I'm just all for her just being happy. And so if that means you guys being together and I got to back down, then I will, you know? Yeah. So I have really nothing against you. I'm finna go. We're finna pull up to the crib. Um, for sure. And we're gonna surprise her. For sure. We're gonna surprise her and just, and just everything, okay? Yeah. I respect that. You respect that? <laughs> I respect that. Why are you talking like you're reading off a script? Like I'm reading off a script? Yeah. That's what it sounds like? Yeah. I respect that. I nah, respect nah, that. you're cool, bro. You know what I'm saying? But I think she'll be really, she's been really sad the past couple of days. Just, um, I just see all the subs on Instagram, like, Fuck niggas named the Shea and hey, my been, big brother. No, they've been bashing. No, they've been bashing me. Bad. They've been bashing me. I got so much hate. I got so much hate. Like, I don't even think, like, honestly, like, I didn't think it was going to be this bad. King most hated. No, literally. I think, <laughs> literally. like, I'm, they hate me. Like, I don't even know. But I just feel like this, I don't know, as I grow, as I get, I get older, so I record everything. So I get older yeah. and I grow on camera. So I feel like this is a good decision to have you walk in, surprise people. You know what I'm saying? Um, they don't shock. Just walking, I mean, some, especially walking in with you. Yeah, some people know, you know what I'm saying? Some people know, not everybody, but Brooklyn doesn't know for sure. So I think some people know you here, but my mom and them, but they know you, Brooklyn doesn't know. So we're going to walk in. For so sure. we cool, bro? Yeah, we solid. We good? Yeah. You know, I always want to make my sister's day, no matter what. If this makes her life, it makes her day, the best Sunday it is, then with all this stuff going on, then so be it. I got to do that for her. And, I, and that's just because I love her. That's because I love it. So anything I do, but you can't fuck that shit up. 
You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So make sure her happiness is still good. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I got you. Because you got to be able to give her stuff that I can't. You know what I'm saying? If I don't have whatever, then that's where you step in as a man to be able to be like, I can, you know, give you my time. Else, if, if I can't, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. If I can't, that's when it's, you have to step in, you know? Yeah, that's where I step in. That's but for sure. Man. We can go. We can finish up there. We'll catch you guys later. All right? All right. All right. So are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Come on. All right, come on. Come on. That nigga's stressing over here. Come on, do it. He trying to talk. He's trying to get his bitch back. He trying to get his bitch back. He lost it. He, he lost it. He trying to get his bitch. <laughs> trying to get his bitch. <laughs> to get his bitch. <laughs> Niggas be talking anything to get out. That was my cousin, nigga. That was my cousin, nigga. You know that's my blood sister, nigga. You know that's my blood sister. <laughs> Shit. You over there, this nigga. Bitch, you know I love you, bitch. Come upstairs. Come upstairs. Come upstairs. Brooklyn, come here. I got a surprise for you. Oh, shit. <laughs> What's wrong? Look, I got a surprise for you, Brooklyn. Look. <gasps> Bro! Turn around. Turn around. Look who's there. Turn around. Look. Look. Turn around. Oh. Brooklyn. Brooke. Brooklyn, turn around. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, just take the gift back. <laughs> Get up. Take the gift back, man. Take, I know, it back. take the gift back. <laughs> Come on, let's go talk, guys. Hold on, let me get this thumbnail real quick. Look at me. Look at me. Come over here. Let me get this thumbnail. Come here. All right. All right, turn around. Oh, I'm going to stop. Do I smile? You ready? Do I smile? Don't grab her ass. Are you ready? All right, come on. You better grab the low kneecap. All right. Ready? One, two, three. Smile. Hello, happy. Not you, Devon. Are you ready? Oh my God. Ready? One, two, one, two, three, go. Look at me, Delane. Wait, Brooklyn, you're moving. You're doing. He's covering his face. Come on. He's not that strong. No, no, no. No, I like the other way. All right, you ready? Ready? Come on, you gotta hurry. We gotta hurry up. All right, you ready? One, two. Come on, come on, come on. Get him up there. Get him up there. All right, one, two, three, go. All right, all right, smile. Hold on, hold on, smile. Brooklyn, smile. Got it, all right. Come on, let's talk to y'all. Can I, the lights go on in here? Yeah. Okay, let's go in here real quick. Hold on, Anthony, I just gotta talk to them real quick. What made you do this? Should have took it. All right, sorry, Delaney. This is Brooklyn's dirty ass closet. I see, I know this. Sorry. Um, really, it's just all right. Jacket, so now, y'all, I'm, I've been talking to him. Uh, you been talking to him? Yeah, just in communication. And I want to say that I do apologize for everything I've done and doing everything that was wrong on my fault. You know everything, but I still do feel like I want you to get your grades up and I want you to do good. Why now listen to this, grades, because I your grades are not grades. good. My, now I know. will let you into this relationship. That's fine, but please promise me that you just do great and that you'll do good. Yeah, you gonna have to get new grades. Exactly, and I told him that they if I'm be down. exactly, you know what they're I'm saying. Not even down. I'm just saying I'll let you be in a relationship, and it's not even like I'll let you. Like you're still gonna do what you want at the end of the day. Right. But I'm just feel like I have to do that in my duty, and just as a big brother, and just but make sure that you're on your stuff. You know. Your your say so is a lot. Yeah, of course. I and I I know that you do think that because I feel like if you feel like I didn't like him, then I don't know. Maybe you might still be in a relationship, or you might not. Who knows? But I'm just saying, like you know. You got my approval. I, I, you know, I approve of this, and it doesn't matter that it does that you get my approval or not. But I'm just saying that I want you to do good, and this is my little gift to you for Easter. You know what I'm saying? Because now we can go live and show the people. Show the people this stuff. They've been wait, They put oh both God, their hearts. So, so how do you feel? I'm happy. Yeah, how you feeling? I'm so happy. I really am. Ouch! 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 Thank you. You're better. Ouch. Thank you. I got you. I got you. Thank you.
Thank you. No problem. I told you. You know what I'm saying? I love you. Oh, okay? brother and sister I love. You, love. You know what I'm saying? Keep on doing your things. I'm you too. You. I'm proud of you. I'm happy you know? that you're happy. I'm always happy. I'm seeing that you're happy now because I know you was up here sad. But I'm seeing that you're happy. I love you. I want you to do great. You want to go get him? Yeah, yeah I drove. Can't I drove all the way to see him, bro. Y'all don't to, to, to far minutes. away, far, two hours, two hours to get this little nigga <laughs> in my car. That's a lot of gas. I know, but I got him for you because I love you. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. Look at you. Can't even be sentimental. You're this your first time being sentimental. You're only sentimental with this nigga. I'm not sentimental. You know you sentimental. No, I'm not. You're going to say that. I seen the phone and be like, love you, baby. All the other shit. Come on, bro. You've no, never said that to me. I do always say I love you. No, you don't. My love runs deeper with you than him. She'd be like, L-U-V. I'd be like, damn. I know. Come on, bro. But I'm some just saying. Be, but some people have a relationship with their brother where they like their, they, they love their boyfriend more than their brother. And that's where I didn't want to happen. Like, you know? And it's just like you're growing up to be like a grown woman. So these are the times that she's gonna be where you um you're finding yourself. You're only sixteen. Around sixteen to nineteen, I was like I'm nineteen right now, but I'm the, those were the times I was finding myself. Seeing what time I still finding myself right now. Finna turn seventeen. Yeah, you know what I'm saying you're fin you're finna turn seventeen? No, you're not. It's four months, yes I am. You're sixteen. I know, finna turn seventeen, August seventeen. Wait, she's sixteen? Nigga, no, she's you, not. This is your sister. Nigga, you're she's 15. You're 16. My yeah, brother is 16. Yeah. No. Yeah, you're 16. And this is the times. How you get confused? I don't know. It's just weird. Yeah, Her, and you and my brother are the same age. But, like, you guys are just, you know what I'm saying? You got. Yeah, he's 15 but oh, y'all, y'all, yo, yo, I'm just saying, like, you know, you guys are doing your thing. I'm just proud of y'all. I want you to be safe and be happy. Make sure you guys know you, these are the times you're finding yourself. So I don't want you to be in a position to where you, you, these are the times where you turn your back and get to me. Now we have a bad relationship. You know what I'm saying? Right. These are the times where I'm supposed to be there for you and just be, oh, my bad. Shit, I was going to turn to a different movie. But you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I was saying, I'm, these are the times I want to, to be able to be there for you and make sure you're good and make sure that you're there mentally, physically, and just make sure you're right. You know what I'm saying? The right headspace to do what you need to do for life because right. these are the years that grown that people are gonna not even judge you not even care but they'll know you for the rest of your life we grew up on the internet you know what i'm saying you're yeah. starting to do that now fucking with us so like she's growing up on the internet since she was 14 you know what i'm saying so it's a different lifestyle than you usually too yeah. so that's what you got to be ready for i've been on the internet since i was 14 so you got to be ready for just little things like you know what i'm saying just like stuff like that and just being able I gotta to be ready for that you too and just what? dealing with this because we're not going down the only thing is up so i'm feeling like that's what females that's what anything you know what i'm saying like all that stuff same thing for you that's for niggas they're gonna do a lot of stuff to get your attention you might think it's something different but it, they only got one thing in their mind so you got to be careful all that be careful what you say everything could be into different interpretations there could be two interpretations you know what i'm saying you got to be careful because the internet's a dangerous place you know and it can make or break a relationship. And that's the thing you don't want to do. You need to be good on off-camera terms to where yeah. you're on cameras where it don't even matter. In any situation that you had with any other girl, any situation you had with any other nigga, I feel like it's good to tell each other right now so nobody looks stupid in the future. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, tell your past relationship with that person. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I just feel like that. I'm like, we're young. You know what I'm saying? But I'm saying, with anything, just so you don't look stupid, like, the bitch, like, oh, yeah, I got, you know what I'm saying? And no niggas, like, oh, you mess with her? I mess with her. You know what I'm saying? So you don't look stupid, like, oh, well, if, and it might be right now, just, oh, you know, oh, we're going to this place. I mess, I, I got that from Iman and, and um, Iman. Tiana, T no, Iman and, Iman Shumpert and Tiana oh. Taylor. They be killing it. They be together for like, oh, for a hell of a year. So I'm just trying to have y'all be like them, you know what I'm saying? But, I love y'all, bro. Love y'all. Y'all be safe. Y'all gotta get out the closet. I'm just gonna leave y'all in the closet. <laughs> y'all still get out the closet. Guess what, y'all? Alright, now I feel like I did my job. So everybody can have a good Easter. Love y'all. Make sure y'all listen to the music. Everything has been solved. We're good. Everybody's good. Thank you guys. Love you guys. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, yeah. Make sure you guys tune into New to LA. Link in the description. Music. Uh, everybody's channel. Subscribe. All that. Let me know what videos you guys want to see. Happy Easter. Love from my family to y'all. And y'all remember. Stay frosty. It ain't. <laughs>